Hey there guys, this is the question of the day. Um, which enemy of spread us is better? We're going to find out right now. Uh, okay guys, um, I watched them recently and judging on what I saw, I think the first one's better because just the story, the scenes, um, just basically the overall story and characters. The second one, it was all about because the first one, the predators helped the humans, but they didn't do anything on the second one. They just kind of helped them, but they got caught up in a battle zone. And if you didn't know, the first one's about that they find a temple and they go there and they dig underneath the ice. And then they find like this temple kind of thing and they realize it's got aliens and, in. And they go there, they get trapped, they set off, like traps coming off, everything. Predators go there to restore all of them, they come back every hundreds of years to see this temple and fight off the aliens. At the end of this time the battle and all that, people are dying and stuff. Really good scenes, really good CGI with the face huggers and the aliens. Uh, like the alien with the um, the like net marks on its head with the green marks. Uh, I like the predators, how they've got skulls on them, different masks, they're cool. Um, and the spoiler, um, the main predator joins force with the main character, the woman, and then they get out, they fight a giant one, falls into the ocean and they win, and the predator gets taken away on the spaceship, and you see that bursts out his chest, which you see the scene before, that it gets out of his face, but you don't see it cuts, but you're thinking, oh, did it or not? And it eventually did. Um, then, yeah, then it comes out to chess so as a predator alien, supposed to join together, and then it um, did it falls on the second film, which you see a boy and his father in the woods shooting, you know, hunting and stuff like that, and then face always jump on his face. You see the spaceships crashed on Earth, which is set at the same time, I think, and. Yeah, then you see that woman just grabbed her army and she's with her partner and her daughter. And then this other guy's get picked on a lot, it's Pete's delivery guy. And the down the sewers, they find them. The Predator, it's basically like Predator and joins together. That's got the, the pincer things and the thing coming out of his mouth and big like, dreadlock kind of things. Um, it's really cool. I thought it was a good part of the second one, but I still didn't like the second one because. The characters just the killing off loads of characters. Um I thought that it was just they just trying to do loads of gory stuff which wasn't needed in a story. Um yeah, they're getting away, they all join together. Uh the, the terrible scene when the girl's running and she's just like the most retardedest person ever and she just runs and she gets predators like blade ring in the neck and then she dies obviously. And then they find the gun off the predator's shoulder. Uh, cause there's only one sent down because the ones are dead. Um, yeah, there's prayers to look for them. They're, yeah, then they find a hostel, and inside the hostel, there's pregnant women, and the powers going off, and just stuff like that. And you see them, and the predator alien lays eggs into their stomach, which I thought was a sick thing. So quite squeamish, but I still watch them. Depends how gory it is. Um, yeah, you can see them. They burst out of the stomachs, and like, oh, it's horrible. You see them go down the neck. I thought it was cool and all, but still, um, yeah, really cool deaths in it. The end part when they're fighting, I thought it was a bit, they're just like two of them fighting, but then the like the it wasn't really good because they were fighting and they take them, they get away, fly off, and then the skies radio in the government or whatever, and they're flying across and they're dropping a nuke on the town. Why could all them out? Which fault was that? I was thinking, oh, why did they do that? They could help them off. But no, they would actually do that if that actually happened. Um, and the guys, you know, dead and the predator and the predator alien are fighting. They both die. And they get away and they get hit by the blast and they crash. Somehow they're still alive and then they get up and the army find them, keep them safe. And yeah.
then the, the government at the end get their device which is on the president's shoulder of course then that's it so there might be a third one so really hope to see that i'll see that in cinema thanks for watching and subscribe